Hey Nanoers, it's Zara. It is Tuesday and it's week two. Um, you should only watch this video if you are in need of a pep talk right now. If you're just like chilling or taking a break or whatever, I recommend not watching this video just yet because you will need a pep talk, you will need a break, you will need this video. So save it till you need it. Okay, so it's week two. And for those of you who have done NaNo before, you know about the Week 2 blues, you know about the Week 2 drama, and for those of you who it's your first year, um, you've probably heard about it. By Week 2, your brain is gone. Completely. Um, you don't feel like anything you are writing is worth anything. You know, you can't get any words out, you have no inspiration, you have no motivation, and when you finally do... You're like, oh my god, what is this? This is horrible. What what did I just do? I just wasted all this time. So these are my tips and my little pep talk for week two to get you over this hump. Because it is there, and if it hasn't happened to you yet, you are lucky, but it is going to happen. This is natural. It happens. Okay, so week two. I recommend not deleting anything, obviously. Everyone always says, don't delete, don't delete, don't delete. Don't delete. Put things in brackets, italicize, it doesn't matter. Even if you decide suddenly you don't like this entire character, you don't like that sentence, you don't like this chapter, this scene, whatever, don't delete it. Because those words can still count, even if they're not going to be in your novel. And this isn't like a cheat sheet way, this is, you know, it says it in no plot, no problem. Don't delete, because this counts as your 50,000 words. You wrote those words during November. For your novel, therefore they count. Do not delete them. Okay? Okay. Find somebody is my next tip. Find somebody, whether it's your parents, your friends, your boyfriend or girlfriend, um, you know, your writing buddy, your apprentice, whatever. Someone that you barely know, you met at one write-in, someone on Facebook, it doesn't matter. Find somebody who will ask you, like, more than one time a day, how are you doing? What's your word count? You know, are you writing? I have a challenge for you. Da, da 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 And if nobody's already doing that, ask somebody. Often people will be like, oh my gosh, yeah, that's so cool. I'd love to do that. I'd love to help. And then, you know, do it because you need somebody there bugging you and annoying you because that is going to keep you going. And if it's somebody that you care about and you talk to and see on a regular basis, then that's great. If it's not, that works too. It's totally, perfectly fine, but you need somebody. Okay, um, tip three. I forgot what tip three is. Um, um, I was doing so well, but my brain is going too much also. Oh, don't freak out too much, okay? If you don't write 1,667 words today, if you're behind, if you just can't go anymore, then stop temporarily. There is no reason to quit. You have two weeks left. You're not even halfway through. If you fall behind, you will have time to catch up. You will. And it's going to suck right now, and you're going to feel bad, and you're going to be like, ah, I'm behind, ah, I can't do this, I have school and work and life, and ah, all this stress, why did I even do this? This is so dumb. I have no motivation. Stop. Stop. Take a break. Go on a walk, go out with your friends tonight, watch a movie, do something that's a total waste of time, but it's something that you enjoy doing. Because you can't just sit and write, you know, it's not good for you. And it's, if you get behind, that's okay. It's not ideal. I have friends who are at over 30,000 right now. That's freaking great. They don't have to write for like days and they can still be ahead. But you don't need to compare yourself to them. And you don't need to be better than them or equal to them. And if you fall behind, it's okay. You have time to catch up. So that is my pep talk thing for week two. And, um, yeah, I will see you guys on the 15th. Good luck! Bye.